wow, I love these double front doors. If you had the space in your home to do something like this, this is something I would definitely do. Now I walk into this front entranceway and the first thing that pops into my mind is it's not your traditional space. There's no closets, there's no storage area, I don't see mirrors here, but what it's for is this bold impact for your guests as they come through the front door and move into the rest of your house. Wow, now this kind of interior design is my style of home. Check out this light fixture. A huge trend right now is actually using light fixtures as pieces of art. Now, keep in mind lighting when you're planning your home because it can really inspire your mood and feelings in the house. This is paper clips, and if I look at it, you would think maybe you could try and do something like this yourself. Uh, but you know what, let's leave it to the experts and just go and buy one. Cork is an excellent option for flooring right now, and in this home it runs throughout the entire main level. You'll notice that cork feels really good to stand on, and that's because it has a natural shock absorbing feel to it, so it's great in areas where you're going to be doing a lot of standing. Recessed lighting can be installed virtually anywhere with a flat surface and electrical access, including vaulted ceilings and archways, underneath the stairs, and even underwater in pools or ponds. This master bedroom has a ton of great light, and the good thing about it, because the lights are flush with a flat surface, it allows other elements of the living space to be the focal point. Now this is one of my favorite master baths I've seen in a long time. Why? Check out these giant windows. I've always wanted to sit in a bathtub like this, stare out the windows at the scenery and not have the neighbors peeking in on you. Chrome faucets can give your home a modern and sleek feel. I love how these ones come right out of the glass. Keep in mind if this is something you want to do, you're going to have to have this mirror custom cut for you. One thing about chrome is that they do get a water resistant buildup. Easy thing you can do, take some vinegar and some water, wipe them down once a week, good to go. Enough with the master, let's head over to where the wine is. Oh, but first, the double-sided fireplace. This is great in a home like this where the spaces overlap because it creates this partial wall that really helps define each of the living spaces. I particularly like this one because no matter where you are on the main level, you can really enjoy the ambiance of the fireplace. wine fridge in the kitchen. This is one of many places that there's wine in this home. But check out on top of it, I love this idea. We go through tons of drinks in my house. So this is just a really accessible area that you can store all your beverages. If you love to cook, check out the counter space in this kitchen. This is huge and what I love about it, if you love to entertain and you happen to be doing all the prep work, you don't have to miss out on the party because people can be sitting here and hanging out with you. And then there's this hood fan. To me, this is the focal point of the kitchen. It's very modern, very sleek. I love it combined with this 
flushed stove here. If you're looking for storage space, this kitchen has a ton of storage space. And talk about storage space. Check this out. Now this is a big butler's pantry. If you're entertaining out there and you don't have time to do the dishes or you don't want to do the dishes, throw them in here and shut the door and no one's ever going to see them. Walking into the living room, the first thing that I'm attracted to are these custom wine racks here. I love that we're just 10 steps away from the kitchen and already there's another entire entertaining area here. This custom distressed mahogany bar countertop was brought in all the way from Georgia. The whole room just really has this great Cuban vibe. If you have children, it can be hard to wrap your mind around how a modern home could work for you. A simple thing you can do, put in a custom baby gate like this. You'll keep your family safe, and at the same time, you're not compromising the aesthetics of your home. Oh wow, how fun is this room? What a great space for kids. These high ceilings make this room feel huge. Check out these polished concrete floors. I love them. And one cool thing about concrete floors is they're a great insulator. So in the summertime, it's nice and cool in here. In the wintertime, it's gonna be really warm. And your feet are never gonna feel chilly down here because there's radiant flooring throughout the entire basement. I love the twist on these Jack and Jill bathrooms. The kids still have their independence because there's sinks on either side. They share the bathtub area, which is great because that's gonna save square footage in your home. The kids happen to get a little noisy in this main area. Right here is the theater room. Great thing about it, it's insulated for sound. Tell them to get in here, shut the door, and you're not gonna hear a peep. Speaking of that, I think I'm gonna take a load off. See you guys next time.